Hi guys, welcome back to another Thrifty Thursday. I wanted to show you, this is the napkin that we made into faux rice paper. Can you see how you can see through it? So I pulled it up before this corner was dry, so I ripped it. So don't do that. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is a really cool texture. This is my little prototype, so it's okay. Um, it's got another little hole there. You got to do it and leave it alone. And don't press too hard. Otherwise, you'll create these little holes there. And that's not all the way through either. There's the backing to that. But, um, yeah, this is cool. I'm definitely going to be doing more of this. And it's flexible. You know, it's like rice paper. It's it's thin, see-through, flexible. You can decoupage with this. You can use it, you know, if you did a bigger piece, use it as a page. So, pretty cool. So, I'm going to start with my Dollar Tree haul. Because I went to a different one. We all have these. I went to a different one, and... There was a couple of things there that mine don't have. And I picked up some of this. Um, it is said that this is like the Beacon 3-in-1 or the Fabri-Tac. So, we'll find out. But I bought three because I couldn't find it in mine. It says, works on foam board, poster, cardboard, and more. But it doesn't say anything about fabric. It's the perfect solution for permanently bonding all types of phone and poster board. It dries fast, dries clear, and remains flexible. Less is more, it says. <laughs> so, it's beacon, so, yeah, it contains acetone. It seems to be the same so we will try it and see that would be cool if it is and then i just got some acrylic paint and i found i got a little jar because i'm going to make um oh now i'm drawing a complete blank Oh my gosh, I'm drawing a complete blank. And this jar might not have a wide enough lid for what I want to do, though. Um, oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm drawing a complete blank. Texture paste. Sorry, I yelled it. I do that. So, I found this ribbon. Well, it's not really ribbon. It's gems. I thought it was pretty. And I haven't seen it there before. And then this is a black sheer. And then I got more of the lace. I used a lot of that lace. And then I saw this one. And this might... It's a purple color. I love this. It looks so pretty. I might use it in the journal that I want to make for my stepdaughter. So, that was Dollar Tree. And then I found some stuff at Goodwill. I got this book. It doesn't mean anything, but I liked the pages. I just love, I probably don't need it, but, you know. Do we ever really need everything that we get? Gray parchment paper, and it's closed. I love using different papers in my journals. I don't like using um, just copy paper. Oh, look, there's a window. So I was looking at, oh, it looks full, too. 
and it's you can almost see my hand this is going to be nice so i paid a dollar 98 for that great price and then a bunch of white envelopes these will dollar 98 these will either be uh for crafting or for mailing there's at least 20 there not more and those are large And then I saw this and I just had to get it. This was $4, has a nice class. Oh look, there's a picture of somebody in here. Um, I have another one that I found like this. It's the same fabric and the same color, um, but it's um, open. It doesn't have the dividers, which can come out. Um, I like to have pretty things in my craft room. And that's what this is going to be for. It can separate my bulb pins, you know, little paper clips. Um, that's what I'm thinking. So I couldn't pass that up. And, you know, blue is my color. That's my color. And then I found some Uno scorecards, $2. So these are cool. Look at the coloring. It's gorgeous. Love it. I haven't seen these before. But that coloring is gorgeous. 1978. Oh, I love it when stuff has a year on it. And then I got some flower sack towels because I bake. So I grabbed those. And then I went to another thrift store. It's the ranch, the sheriff's ranch thrift store. Green was 25% off and yellow was 50% off. So this was 50 cents and then 25% off of that. And it's some bags. I want to find smaller ones. But these are actually a good size for putting in your journal. And then this was 50 cents and they are tissue and very pretty. This is more like wrapping paper. That's wrapping paper. That's not tissue. I was hoping it was tissue. So it's not what it says it's in the bag. Actually, it doesn't need to go in there. Well, that's not fun, but... I'll use it for something. And then we got some glue, and that was a dollar. And I think yellow was regular price. And I found ribbon. Whoops. Sorry, guys. Ribbon. I find ribbon every time. And again, green. What I say? Green was. No, yellow was 50% off. So the glue sticks were 50 cents for the two. I don't think I have a yellow one like this. And I need to make some bows. So all of these were 50 cents. And this gold one was half off. And I love that gold one. This is a pretty blue. And then a pretty purple. This is the color purple that my stepdaughter likes. So, bow size. And then this is stretch cord for 50 cents. That will come in handy. And then I just got one book and this is a prayer and devotional. 
And what I like about it is it has affirmations in it and it has scripture in it and then it has a prayer. But I like the scripture and the affirmations in it um, and a small devotional. And, you know, I, I would like to use these in the journals. Cut, cut out the affirmation or cut out the scripture and coffee dye the pages. And this is from 2001. And it's Embraced by the Light, Prayers and Devotions for Daily Living by Betty e. J. Eady. And then I found wallpaper, 50 cents. Let's open this up. I can see a rose on it, which made me very happy because I don't think I have rose wallpaper. You'd think the label would tell you the name of the wallpaper. And why is that sticker so sticky? Oh my goodness. I'm trying guys. There we go. Oh, that is so pretty. There's the rose. Oh, that's beautiful. Can you even see all of that? That is gorgeous. And look at the butterfly right there. Yes. Oh, wow. I got lucky with this. 50 cents. And I grabbed it because I saw the rose right there. And I wanted some rose. Yeah, it's funny how it just village. I guess that's the name of it. And then I got these for 50 cents and yellow or what half off. So there's 10 tags in here. Yeah, they're uh, black cardstock paper. So these will be awesome. I'm happy with those. And then this one, these are were $2, so they were 25% off their green ticket. These are images. It says 20 selected views of Greenfield Village in Dearborn, Michigan. My mom's from Michigan. I have to see if these, if she knows that where these are. So these are images. How cute are these? And then it tells you about, um, about what the image is. But I thought these were so cool. Like that one would be awesome in the farm journal, but look at how old these images are. I don't see a date. Look at that. I love these. Look at that one. Look at the church. Beautiful. Oh, I love that with the star in the middle of the clock. Beautiful. So I will have fun with these for sure. So that was my share. That was pretty quick. I thought it would be longer. Well, that is it, guys. So I guess I will see you next time. Take care.